Question. A 45-year-old female patient presents with a sudden onset severe headache, visual disturbances, and right-sided weakness. Upon examination, you note a blood pressure of 210-120 mmHg, and fundoscopy reveals papilledema. The non-contrast head CT scan shows a hyperdense area in the left basal ganglia region. What is the most likely diagnosis? You note a blood pressure of 210-120 mmHg, and fundoscopy reveals papilledema. A non-contrast head CT scan shows a hyperdense area in the left basal ganglia region. What is the most likely diagnosis? A. Ischemic stroke. B. Intracerebral hemorrhage. C. Migraine with aura. D. Subarachnoid hemorrhage. Correct answer B. Intracerebral hemorrhage. This patient presents with several concerning signs and symptoms, which when considered together, strongly suggest intracerebral hemorrhage, ICH. Sudden onset severe headache, a sudden and severe headache is a common symptom of ICH. It often occurs abruptly and is described as one of the worst headaches a person has ever experienced. Visual disturbances, visual disturbances can occur in ICH, often due to the increased intracranial pressure. Papilledema, swelling of the optic disc, noted on fundoscopy is an indicator of increased intracranial pressure. Right-sided weakness, the right-sided weakness suggests a neurological deficit, which can occur when the bleeding in the brain affects motor functions. Hypertension, the elevated blood pressure of 210-120 mmHg is commonly seen in ICH. It can be both a cause and a consequence of the bleeding. CT scan findings, the non-contrast head CT scan showing a hyperdense area in the left basal ganglia region is highly suggestive of intracerebral hemorrhage. The hyperdensity represents the presence of blood. Ischemic stroke, option A, typically presents differently, often with gradual onset and focal neurological deficits. Migraine with aura, Option C, can cause visual disturbances but does not usually present with sudden severe headaches and right-sided weakness. Subarachnoid hemorrhage, option D, typically presents with a severe headache but often with associated neck stiffness, meningeal signs, and it does not typically cause visual disturbances or focal neurological deficits. Given the patient's presentation, hypertension, and the CT scan findings, intracerebral hemorrhage is the most likely diagnosis, and urgent evaluation and management are crucial in such cases.